Hello, live. It's your boy Mike Rich. What's happening with y'all today? Kiki Rich. Hey, y'all. How you doing, baby? I'm good. How y'all doing? What's with all them love? Because I ain't seen them in a long time. You gotta get on this side. I don't even want to hear y'all. I'm just used to holding the camera anyway. You'll be alright. You'll be alright. You'll be alright. Anyway. She always gotta argue with me. This is what 20 years look like. It's what 20 years look like. We made it though. But anyway, we blessed, and I'm hoping everybody, each and every last one of y'all, is having a blessed day today, man. We are a different area this time. Where we at? Sugarloaf Mills. Sugarloaf. We are. What is this from my house? It smells some cologne. It's loud. Yeah, like that cause that person made me stuff. Oh, okay. I need some cologne too. I ain't going to them. We are in Lawrenceville, Georgia, right? Yes, we are in Lawrenceville, Georgia, which is the exact opposite side of the town that we live on. It's like almost an hour away from our house. Right. Almost an hour away, and we're right by Soul Play too, which is probably why you never see me do Soul Play vlogs because anybody been driving no hour? I gotta go to work. Hey, talking about. But anyway, sometimes I have time. Anyway, babe. I saw some. Of you. you saw some. You wanted already. Yes, I'm just trying to let them know where we at. We getting ready to go on the Reacher Cruise. Nike Factory Outlet Store. I feel like that was the intro. Anyway. I was I was trying to do the intro. You ain't rubbing me. We're gonna get together for this little cruise. Y'all should have came with us. Cause I don't think this. We invited everybody. To but this is, these are my people though. Oh, I forgot. I'm sorry. Maybe I wanted to buy that. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> I saw a little cute outfit in here. I think I'm going to go get it. Anyway, go, man, because you don't got on my nerves already. We just got here. Is that Medieval Times right That's Medieval Times right there. It is. It's boring. Kiki don't like Medieval Times. It's not that I don't like Medieval Times. I actually do like Medieval Times, but it's just, it's, it's probably about 45 minutes too long. That's all. It's like 45 minutes. For sure. Yes. Like, they could have. We didn't need an intermission. Just whatever the first part was, and that was it. I ain't never been. It was, it was like. But that chicken you brought home was good. And I that, that, that toasted that bread. Not like the best food I had eaten. I don't know. I guess I was just hungry that day. Um, I might have been under the influence or something like that. But anyway, uh, so we're in the Nike factory outlet store. And let's see if they have anything. I'm not seeing much. We just walked in. I'm not seeing hardly much, but we're going to check it out, y'all. Oh, so today, I forgot to tell y'all. There'd be so many people in hell, bro. It'd be in the way. Today, I got on Air Jordan One Low Travis Reverse Mocha things cleansed, in my humble opinion. And I also have on a um, like a vintage style cream Michael Jordan Four Championship T. So that's my outfit. I got all these uh. I bought those last time when I was in Florida. What you call them? Roshi Runs. And then they got all the colors. And they be they be for the Lolo. I might get more. Huh? Them joints are comfortable. They got these off-whites, man. Off-white Air Force One. But the leather is really good on these. The shoes, I can't do the banana guys, man. I mean, honestly, if you if you got the right drip, you can pull these off. They just ain't for me. What's up with the little Grim Reaper, though? What do these mean? What that mean? Halloween gang. He ain't talking about... Um, Try to think about off white. We ain't been getting no dope off whites lately. They ain't been dropping no off white like that. But the leather is really good. I, I like when leather look like that. When it look textured like that and soft, it's good leather. But as far as the shoe, hell's no. But they got they got sizes. They got a twelve right now. So if I want them for one hundred and sixty four dollars, then you can't beat an off white for one hundred and sixty four dollars just for, on quality alone. But like I said, your drip got to be impeccable. You got to know how to. Put it on to put them on. Here you talking about? Got the red, excuse me, bro. Go ahead, man. Thank you. Red Air Max 270s for 120. All red, guys. These be my vacation shoes right here, Charlie. But they got a 12, too. Mm. I ain't never had no 270s. Are they comfortable? Y'all come below. Bro, my wife say I'm rude, but I be trying not to be, man. But. I promise you, whenever I'm at outlets, bro, it be so many people here, and they be bumping up against you. They don't be saying, skew me. They be like, boring you out the way, and bro. They be like, bro, move. Hey, you talking about? <laughs> so, Roshi's are similar prices to the uh, what they was in Florida. $29, $29. I got these for $22. I forgot to say that when I was recording the video. I put in a little voiceover in the end of the video. I don't know if y'all caught it, but $22 I caught these for. And they super comfortable, and they look dope on feet, honestly. Seems like every every outlet is keeping these on deck. These Mauve Air Jordan 1 Highs, 140 It's a pretty good price. That should be the retail, but 
Um, 109, wifey wanted these right here. She wanted another pair, so if they got a size, I might get her another pair. Seems like the smallest they got is a seven, so that might be perfect. Oh, might be a pickup for the wifey, shawty. Yes, sir. So, wifey might be good for the double up. Any you talking about? Also, they got the um, elephant print Air Jordan 1 highs for 150. They didn't have these at the Florida outlets, I don't think. I don't remember seeing them, but it's a good price. But I went, I, for $89.99, I'll put a trick on these. And they got one size 12 down there. Also, white infrared, like I told y'all last time, $89, even $100. Maybe $100, i jump on these. I love sevens. They almost finna make me double up on these. They be $100, I damn sure would double up. I have no idea what I need two pair for, but sometimes, like my boy T. Ward say, when it's a steal, you gotta get that deal. Air Jordan 7s. Y'all disrespecting them so much, but especially these, man. These was like really anticipated by a lot of people. Then when they drop, if they, I don't know if they drop too many or just people like, I don't like Jordan 7s. That's probably, probably the latter. Hey, you talking about 129 for the twos. Like I said, just like in Florida outlets, I didn't realize the outlet by me had all these kicks. The Tanger outlet I usually go to, they don't have as much stuff as this one do. Um, like I said, this is Sugarloaf Mills, Lawrenceville, Georgia. Gwinnett County, 199 for those. I mean, 99 for those. And um, got the uh, wheat Air Jordan 13s for 160. Like I said, man, y'all wait around. If you get them when they first drop, nine times 10, general release Jordans, they're gonna end up at the outlets, man. But where these is, man? Where these is? Air Zoom JT Hustle. Boy, they, done, they gonna slap that air on side of anything. Track can, water. I like the OG Harachis right here. This is size 12. I wear 13 in Harachis because them things run snug as a mug. Yeah, you talking about. Um, but let me see how much to pray. 119 plus 20% off. So these would be less than $100, man. I haven't bought a pair of Harachis in a long, long time. No Nike Outlaw is done until you see plethoras upon plethoras of Air Jordan. Nathaniels. All kinds of Nathaniels. Here you talking about? Uh, this is crazy. Additional 30% off lowest ticket, lowest ticketed price. Didn't these just drop? Didn't these just drop, bro? I could have swore I just did a video. These just dropped, bro. And outlets. Like those wifes. Wifeies. Got the gold guys in here. Those are kids? Some of these are kids. We got these Jordan 2. I forgot the girl name who designed these Jordan 2s right here. Let's well, see it. Women's Air Jordan 2 Low Retro. You like those kicks? Uh uh. She ain't messing with them. They look a little generic. But what these here? Dinosaur shoe. Reptilian moccasins. Hey, you talking about Kiki? You want some? What? What them thing? What's them thing they be eating on uh, naked and afraid? Caymans. Cayman skin shoe. <laughs> uh oh, they got a set side 12 in the AJKO breads, man. I already got them. But, uh,. These 109, 30% off. Yeah, you talking about? I remember during COVID, bro, anything that had this colorway, like mids, lows, highs, it don't matter. People were buying them, Charlie. They were selling out. It ain't matter these Air Max Pluses. The joints are my size, too. Not bad. They got Laney, Laney Air Jordan 1s over here in the women's. And then they got the uh, these joints right here, too. The praline guys. What are they doing with all these Laney's? These joints didn't come in my size, bro. I don't think. I felt like they was extended, though. The biggest size I see is a women, women's 10, so maybe not. Then, let's go around to the other side. They got I'm on Meniere's, just like the last outlet, but they don't have really big sizes. They got like six and a half is like the biggest size. Um, these Jordan 2s for the ladies right here. Colors ain't bad. Lucky Green Air Jordan 2 for the kids, $89. GS cleansed. There's a lot of people trying on shoes in there, guy boy. Some 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 sock flip pungent smells going on in there, guys. Uh, <laughs> uh, but anyway, man, they got a lot of stuff, bro. They got a lot of Jordans. They got a lot of they got a lot of stuff. You just some Ama Maneers, Keith. What? You just Ama Maneer 12s. You mess with him? Uh-uh. Okay. Alright, man. Back at the crib. This is the next day, actually. Sunday morning. Uh, <laughs> that was Saturday. 
that was a big mall. Like me and my wife walked around that thing a couple of times. Went to see the movies. We went to see the movies. We went to the movies. We got a bunch of pickups. Well, not a bunch, but more than we. I usually I, I usually do most of my vlogs, and I don't even grab nothing because, as you can see, I don't really, I don't really need a whole lot of shoes. But anyway, got my jaw week shirt on today. Bye bye. How you doing? Bye bye. Um, busting them guns. Here you talking about? Oh, uh, what am I finna say? I get on here sometimes and forget what I'm finna say. So, oh yeah, we went to go. We went to the movies, bro. <sighs> don't go silver. Don't go see Civil War. Wait, I'm, I'm gonna save y'all some time. Don't go see the movie Civil Civil War. Don't go see it. Cause it ain't it ain't what you think it is. It ain't what you think it is, man. It's trash can water. Halfway through the movie, me and wife were like, and then we went to go see it in Dolby. And Dolby, if y'all know what Dolby is, they got the loudest sound ever. I can't count how many times guns started going off out of nowhere. No, nothing you ain't even expect it coming up. And sometimes if the movie was good, that'd be fun. That'd add to it. But that, that was on a trash out so. Anyway, like I said, you want to go see it, see it at your own risk. I thought it was trash. Wasn't nothing like I expected. I'd rather, I'd rather watch Captain America Civil War than to watch this Civil War a million times. You see, I need to go check that. I need to go downstairs, go on Disney Plus and put that Captain America Civil War on. That was a good, mo good movie. Winter Soldier. He was all that. Uh, no, that ain't Winter Soldier. That's another whole different movie. That, Cap Civil War was the one with all the Avengers fought each other and Tony Stark and Captain America. Anyway, man, pickups, pickups, pickups. Me and the wife, and I, she already said it earlier in the video, and a bunch of our people from my other channel, The Riches, which is a channel I don't post on nowhere near as much as I should. We might put like two videos up a month, if that. Need to start being more consistent on that thing, man. It's a must. Um, but uh, every couple of years, well, this is our second time doing it. It's our second annual Riches trip. First time we went to Miami, you know what I'm saying? This is a lot of people we met, mostly during COVID, during 2020. That's when we did our Friday Night Lives every Friday, and a lot of people joined in, and we met a lot of good friends on there and stuff. So them, a lot of us just get together and go on a trip. And last time we went to Miami, it was lit. We had a good time. This time we going on a cruise. Royal Caribbean's Allure of the Seas, one of the, it was, one, it was the biggest cruise ship of about 10 years ago. But they got other ones bigger now. But it's a huge cruise ship, man. We're going to have a good time, man. Me and wifey, we went on. Well, she went on this one before. And I went on one that's probably the same size, the Oasis of the Sea. I love cruises, man. They dope. They fire. A lot of people don't like being out there on that water, man. But you got to go when it ain't hurricane season. We going like next month. So it'll be like, you know, summertime action. So we're going to have a good time. But said that to say. We need we needed a couple of things for the cruise, a couple of cruise attire pieces. So it ain't like I'm gonna be pulling out a whole bunch of Jordans and height pieces. But we got one, two, three, four, five. We got like five pairs of shoes, and we ain't spend a whole lot of money either. So five pairs of shoes and um, a couple more things. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into the first thing. When I went to the outlets last time, uh, I got a pair of these, and then this time. Kiki bought a pair of these, and I bought another pair of these because they was on sale for twenty nine dollars. Kiki went and got the same colorway I got, and that's the Roshi runs. The um, he's right here, man. She got the same colorway I got. What, what's this colorway anyway? This is Siren Red, After Sight, and Siren Red. So Roshi run, guys. Y'all know I got these last time I was there. She tried this one on seven size seven, fit perfect for the Keeks. You know what I'm saying? Then I went. I said $29, man. That's the thing about it. We're going to excursions and stuff like that. You want a pair of comfortable shoes. You got to wear sneakers. You got to wear some kind of shoes. You can't just wear slides and stuff when you, on certain excursions and stuff like that because that's just not good for your feet to be exposed. Um, and I went and got me another pair, too. I already got that colorway. And then I went and got this one, which I should have got last time. It's kind of like a, a, a olive with a volt neon kind of bottom, man. You know what I'm saying? So, I wear, I wear these in a size 11 and a half. They run a little big in the toe, so. You know what I'm saying? Some, some slight, you know what I'm saying, for the trip. I ain't gonna worry about beating these up and I ain't gonna worry about having to have on slides and stuff with my feet exposed. You know what I'm saying? Depending on what excursions we decide to do. You know what I'm saying? So, that's, that's some kicks right there. And then next up, what is it? Oh, this wifey clothes, I ain't gonna show all that. Wifey bought a couple of like Nike outfits just to kind of wear out there. Um, like I said, 
on the trip. Uh, and she also bought these, which are fire, in my humble opinion. Let's go ahead and check them out. She bought some Air Max ones, black, white, white, black, however you want to say it. Cleansed shoe, in my humble opinion, simple. It was between these and she saw, she wanted white, black shoes or black and white shoes. Um, Jordan 1 Low, um, non OG cut, she was, she was about to get those. And then she saw these and then she asked my opinion and I was like, go with the Air Max. Go with the Air Max ones because they cleansed, in my humble opinion. You feel me? Uh, these was retail though, which I think was about whatever retail is, 120, something like that. Um, and then went to Finish Line. But well, that shoe was from Finish Line. But another thing I got for the outlets, I've been looking for these damn socks for a long time. I be people be posting on feet videos and on feet. Uh, Instagram posts and stuff like that and it, it's just a simple Jordan sock but I was like bro why I can't find this sock nowhere so when I, I saw it right before we left out of uh, the outlets and they twelve ninety nine dollars for what three three pairs and they're the, uh, just a plain Jordan 23 sock kind of like the pixelated 23 the 8 bit if you will 23 with the red the black and red it goes with so many of my sneakers like half of my sneaker collection each other shoe part. every OG Jordan I got it go with I got three pairs they got a little Jordan on the body anybody gonna see that but the like Air Jordan and um that noise sound no alarm going off for a minute but um here the, the Jordan socks man I, I was like bro I finally found this sock and it's, so, it's such a simple sock you could probably get it made or something like that but I want the official the official tissue says Jordan Essentials and for twelve ninety nine, dollars man, three pair of these, man. I had to have it, bro. Had to have it. Finally found them socks. And then, last but not least, y'all, we went to Ross. We went to Ross. They had a Ross in that. They had everything in that in that mall, man. These are some um, multicolored, crayon-colored vans that was on sale at Ross. I think it was like 20-something bucks. This is for Harley, my daughter. And then, we saw these before we left, like, Kiki got her pair first. This is Kiki pair, I think. Yeah, that's a little bit bigger than Harley. So Kiki saw her pair first. And then right, we were looking for Harley some. You know what I'm saying? Because I mean, I mean for the price, you can't really beat that for the price. Like 20 bucks or something, $22 or something like that. So we saw Kiki pair. And she was trying her best to find Harley pair. And then right before we left, we was checking out at the rest. There was a long line in there too, just ridiculous. People shopping like crazy. And at the rest, I was like, hey, they got they go they got some little ones over there. She was like, go see what size. And they was it's like one half size up from what Harley was. So thing heavy. He miss so what he miss old made out of shot with these these vans. Um and then last but not least, Kiki was like, You're gonna need some boat shoes. She said, You're gonna need some boat shoes. I was like, man, I don't really want to win no boat shoes like that, man. I used to rock boat shoes all the time, like on the boat, on the on the cruise. I, like when we go to like, you have these special dinners you go to on the cruise boat. I don't know if y'all know, you have to dress a little bit more casual. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, it's not like no sneakers allowed, but it's it's like it's like clean if you got like the boat shoes with no socks look going on. But I found these right here, bro. These guys, these guys are some polo, bro. These are polo boat shoes. I looked online. This shoe retail for like two hundred something dollar, bro. And um, we saw him in Ross, yo. Saw him in Ross. This is size eleven. Usually, both shoes running kind of big. I wear a twelve. With no socks, these things fit perfect. And they was thirty six dollars. There you go. There got the price right there. Thirty six dollars at Ross. Polo boat shoe, really good quality. Uh, I'm gonna say sneakers, really good quality shoes, man. Polo guy, hey, I'm be rocking them, man. You feel me? We go to like I think Chops Grill is one of the, the restaurants up there, man. I'm going them thing. I'm gonna go in there cleanse. You feel me? You know, and I probably got a million sneakers I could wear, but gotta switch it up sometime, man. You feel me? So anyway, I don't know what fit I'm gonna wear with it. I think I got some some Ralph that I can still wear in here. Um, my wife leaving to go pick my daughter up. Anyway, that's it, man. So, I appreciate y'all for watching. Comment below and tell me what you think about the vlog. Comment below and tell me what you think about the pickups and all that good stuff. I appreciate y'all. Hit the thumbs up, like the video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up to the moon on them.
That was whack. I'm tired, bro. <laughs> that was whack. I had a long night. Anyway, keep watching my videos because that's what I'm here for. Gone. Watch me go stupid the Dara. Check out my kiss in the para. Rich like a king of fairy, yeah. Yeah, air captain, they calling me jet like I'm sparrow. East Atlanta in my blood, the streets got me twin like Tia to Mary, yeah. Watch out with the Camaro. Stay out my lane is too narrow. God more, God more, stay and bless. I'm keeping my eye on the sparrow. Man of the people you did, they singing my name just like it's a carol. Cause my got the juice by the berry, yeah. I can't really help it, bro. They know that I'm the ish, yeah. Catch me boss of sauce and might just pull up right at wish, yeah. LBRG me, now I'm Gucci. Gucci. Bricks. But when I step out, bro, it's 10 for 10. I don't miss Rich.